Okay, Ole Miss 351 students, this one's just for you. Uh, this is larger. Cop grabs the whole screen. We've got a website, and we want to prove that we can um, calculate our grade in Ole Miss 351 in Excel. So we know how to use Excel. So that's going to be easy to add a page. We're going to add a page and take a picture of our Excel thing and paste it in as a picture. That's how we're going to do this assignment, the virtual case number one. So here's Excel. We come here. You're going to have to do 10 names here, and your VC2 has to be the last two digits of your Z number. Other than that, this is all made up, so no confidentiality breached. We have everything in the class. Participation, virtual cases, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then we have the VC average. There's the formula. Quiz, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. There's the quiz average, dropping the lowest score. We have a final exam, a final grade percentage, and then this grade is calculated using this table and a VLOOKUP function. So that's pretty intense. It's not that bad. We'll go over that in class too, but and you can see the formulas there. You can figure that out pretty quick. You'll do all 10 of yours. Okay, we've done this. Now I want to get it on the web page to prove to the TA and to Dr. Downing I know how to do it. So I have this Excel up and I want to take a picture of it. To do that I say Alt Print Screen. ALT lower left on your keyboard and upper right PRTSCN on a PC. Alt Print Screen. That puts it in the clipboard. Then I want to get Paint. If you don't see Paint here, go to All Programs, Accessories, Paint. It's just an easy photo editor. Uh, I want to get like a little, a little thing. If this isn't little, hit Resize and make it like 5%. Make the little white thing really little because then when you paste your picture in, it'll only paste. It won't have white space on the bottom. So there's my picture. I found that on a Google page, this is too small for people to see. So I resize it and kick it up, believe it or not, 300%. And that screwed that up. That didn't do the whole picture. So I do a control Z to edit out of there. Okay, there's a paste. I need to make sure I've selected my picture. There we go. Resize 300%, not 600. 300%, I want it to be three times bigger. There it is. Now it's nice and big. I'm going to save it. Uh, I'll save it to your class um, as a JPEG, and I will call it um, grades. Grades.jpg, a picture. So there it is. I can get out of paint. Now I've made another one with the formulas. If you look at this, uh, this is really nice. Uh, how did I get this? I took that page I just did, and you go to formulas, and right here, here I click show formulas you can toggle that on or off in, an, in a spreadsheet so you can show your users in the sheet itself the formula so they can see them all now I can't see this whole thing so I'm gonna we know what these are from the other ones I'm gonna hide these columns so I go here to format and I'm gonna say hide these columns and I don't need to show all the quizzes again because we have that in my other one so I go here format and I say hide columns and that's good enough. Now I take a picture. Alt print screen. Go back to paint. Again, now this is too much white space, so I resize this to get it really small. And then I paste it in just, oops, not paste from, but just paste. There's my formulas. Now I want to click out of that before I resize to 300%. Make it bigger. 300. Bam. Save it and it's JPG JPEG so I called my first one grades and I'll call my first one grades formulas you can see I've already did it done it once formulas and save it now I have these two things saved as pictures I don't need my Excel anymore don't have to save that get out of Excel now I'm in my Google site thing and I need to add a page, two pages in fact. I'm going to add the first one and I'm going to call it grades. This is pretty easy. I want it at the top level. I'm ready to go. I click create. There's grades and I just want to put the picture in. So I click on the box right here, right there, and I say insert. Again, it's an image from a drive. I want to upload a photo, same as I did before. I go here. I find my OMIS classes, in my case, is where I stored the file. And for you folks, fall 2013, I called it grades. I just did it here at 737 at night. It uploads the picture, and oh no, it's not big enough. I, you don't know that yet, but you'll see it in a second. 